All right. Dog cutting toenails 101. You have to look for this red line that goes up. And you can't cut through those, otherwise they'll bleed. This one's going to be a problem, but I will probably stop right here. And I was pretty, pretty clean. But look at how they're curving. And I'll get back to you when I get them cut. You need a set of clippers like these. And you have to have a uh, dog that doesn't mind it. My dogs actually hate this. Or you gotta take them out and walk them on concrete and wear them down. That one I'm not gonna mess with. Because it's got red. It looks like a bloodline goes all the way out. Now you'll be better. Go to come. He won't come. He don't want shit cut. Come here. Dakota, come. Come. Dakota, come. He don't want his shit cut. I'm gonna tell you straight up. They don't. They don't like it. But you can take him to a shop and they're gonna do the same damn thing. Or they, they'll use the grinder, and Dakota hates the grinder. It's a lot faster just to use a set of cutoffs like these. And be done with the job. Dakota, come. Dakota! Dakota! Come! Get up here! Come! Come here! Jack! Now this guy's been through more cutoffs in his lifetime than Iowa has a clue of. Maybe it's a control thing. I've done this for at least 10 years on this dog. Never made him bleed, never hurt him. But he don't like it. Probably because he's put in a submissive position. Just relax. I got your back. You're my boy.
This one's burling big time. How are you?